six Atlantic Lady and box eight is Red Potion. Now they're all locked away. Fourth event, 400 metres the journey. Set for a start. Favourite in one, they're set, they're racing this time. Bungalow Erin began well, but headed early by Burnt Fury. Burnt Fury leads into the back from Bungalow Erin second. Then came Cal Thorpe, the last pair of Red Potion and Atlantic Lady. Off the back, Bungalow Erin railing through on the inside of Burnt Fury. There's six on the rest, headed by Red Potion. Around the turn they swing, and Bungalow Erin works to the lead, and Bungalow Erin will score by five. Second, Burnt Fury. Third went to Red Potion in front of Atlantic Lady, and back at the rear of the field was Calthorpe. Race time around 23 and 80 for the favourite there, number one, Bungalow Erin. Began OK, was headed early by Burn Fury, but down the back, railed up underneath that greyhound, worked to the lead and has ran, ran away to uh, score well there. Bungalow Erin over number four, Burnt Fury, and eight will get third there, Red Potion. Should be one, four, eight, and the race time there of 23 and 79 recorded by Bungalow Erin taking out race number four on the program here today. One, four, eight, six confirmed placings. That uh, winner, number one, Bungalow Erin, white and black bitch, whelped in June 19 by Pure Titanium from Bungalow Sunset. The Bungalow Syndicate, the owners, manager E. Newbury and trained by John Little. Second to number four, Burnt Fury for trainer Tony Hinchinson. And third into number eight, that being Red Potion for Robert Proctor. One, four, eight, six gets fourth, 23.79 that race time recorded. And the uh, margins will be through in a moment after the running of race number four. And there they are, six lengths, an easy win. Two and a quarter between second and third. Six by two and a quarter. And there is the all clear right to 